Welcome to the Impact with AI SDG series. I'm your host, Brandon Andrews, excited to dive into another conversation with an entrepreneur using artificial intelligence to impact the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals. Today, I'm joined by Cynthia Orofo, founder of Culture Care Collective. Cynthia is based in Boston, Massachusetts in the United States. Cynthia, welcome to the conversation. How are you and Culture Care Collective delivering impact? We connect community health workers and healthcare teams through our supportive technology to provide care management guidance for people with unmet social needs. Community health workers can act like social coaches and health coaches to support minoritized populations who use our digital care coordination platform to learn more about their conditions and how to stay healthy and connected to services. In our care model, Clients are matched with a community health worker or health coach who is responsible for providing health and social support. And then the client can be an individual with chronic conditions or someone just looking to improve their wellness. The community health worker is integrated into a clinical care team alongside nurses, primary care physicians, et cetera, to provide social support that's consistent with the medical plan of care. This support can include basic education, goal setting, health system navigation, and connections to public and social services. Our socially informed approach to care management and health promotion enables us to support those with inadequate access to health care due to geographical, socioeconomic, or other systemic factors, or those who have a limited knowledge of health systems. This is through both the community health workers, and supportive technology to extend care management beyond healthcare settings. Thanks, Cynthia. I think that full service approach, making sure you're incorporating the social determinants of health is incredibly important to make sure people get the health services that they need, where they need them, and when they need them. Now let's talk about the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals, specifically SDG3, Good Health and Wellbeing. How are you and Cultural Care Collective impacting SDG3? So the progress I think that we're making on the SDG3, which is to ensure healthy lives and promote well-being at all age, um, is a significant global progress. Um, we see that there is an effort worldwide towards promoting the health and well-being of the public in recent years. Um, and because non-communicable diseases like cancer and heart disease have a high mortality rate globally, we've been forced as a global health community to take a closer look at systemic factors that cause disparate outcomes for different groups. Now, the social determinants of health is a term that's been highlighted frequently over the last year, and rightfully so, considering they account for about 30 to 55% of health outcomes. And with the majority of the world's population having at least one unmet social need, bridging the gaps in healthcare delivery, access, and knowledge for all, is crucial in achieving this sustainable development goal. Thanks so much, Cynthia. Bridging that gap in the delivery of healthcare services is so important if we're going to reach the SDG3 metrics by 2030, the end of the goal period. Okay, Cynthia, would love to hear how are you using artificial intelligence to deliver impact? Now, how are we using AI? Part of our digital health platform facilitates direct communication and care coordination between community health workers and their clients. The incorporation of AI in our digital platform enhances these interactions, extending the manual support that community health workers already provide to clients. This is primarily through on-demand services connections based on evolving social needs, automated health and social wellness recommendation, as well as personalized wellness reports based on user data. So clients can learn how to navigate services for non-critical health and wellness needs in an interactive way using our solution. And AI also helps to anticipate the needs um, of the client and deliver appropriate health recommendations based on these needs that are consistent with the medical plan of care. Okay, Cynthia, now it's time for the big question that I'm asking everyone that I talk to. Can AI rescue the UN Sustainable Development Goals? I believe AI can rescue SDGs. Yes, I believe so. However, AI alone cannot do it. Um, 
it cannot fully replace a human being, but it can only enhance the interactions through automated guidance. So it should be considered like a compass in the hands of a captain. Therefore, AI can be a tool in helping those who are not well connected to health services or workers. Considerate design and incorporation of AI in healthcare can provide a roadmap to holistically address uh, challenges in social and health well being in global communities by anticipating and focusing on evolving health needs. Also, taking a participatory, uh, community based participatory approach can also ensure AI enabled tools are iteratively designed to meet the challenges of these dynamic needs of populations that it's intended to help. Okay. Thank you again, Cynthia and Culture Care Collective for the incredible work that you were doing, helping bridge the gap between communities and the healthcare services that they need using artificial intelligence. Excited to see you and your business continue to grow. Thank you.